channel I'm going to be talking about how much I made on my very first paycheck as a new grad nurse um, I wanted to put this out there because before I was even a nurse I didn't really know how much nurses made I mean you could search up on Google like how much do nurses make how much does a salary of a nurse um, but no one ever gave me a like this is how much and I know it varies depending on where you live I live on the West Coast. I live in Washington. Um, so I will be giving you a breakdown of what my first paycheck was like, how many hours I worked, and all the deets to that. So I just want to say that my very first paycheck as a new grad nurse, this was in 2022. Um, it's the year that I graduated. And so I also want to say that I did have a bonus, um, a sign on bonus. So that makes a difference in the paycheck. But like I said, I think this is very important and I just want to be very vulnerable because I think it's important to know. I mean, if you're a nursing student or even thinking about going to nursing school, um, what it is that they pay. I think that's so important. We don't usually talk about salaries, how much we make an hour, nothing like that. Um, but I think this would be very amazing to hear as a student or a nursing to be um, inspired. Um, so. Like I said, let's talk about this. I wrote everything down in my notebook. Um, I had to go back and look at my first paycheck, but as a group, as a, I can't talk today. <laughs> as a new grad nurse um, in 2022, and this is in the state of Washington, I know it varies from hospital to states, um, but I was making an hourly rate of 33.83. So that's what I started making as a new grad nurse. Um, and that specific, paycheck um of course there's like education hours and things like that so it defers a little bit um and i know they do do evening pay or nighttime pay but i was working day shift so i didn't get any of those extra evening or night pay so this is solely um just my flat rate what i got 33.83 um i did work 73 basically almost 74 hours in this period, pay period. And I want to say that taxes are a big one. So I did have a sign-on bonus of $3,000. Um, so that makes a make big difference. So my gross pay was 5,547 with 79 cents. That being said, that's with my bonus added on of $3,000. Um, Taxes, they took out $1,226.10. It's like, what? That is a lot in taxes. It's so crazy. Um, so that sign-on bonus was taxed like crazy. And also, I did have my 401k, um, those little things that get pulled out of your paycheck. Um, and then as well, um, like cafeteria charges, how much I um, basically spent getting food. Um, I just want to say you can save a lot of money if you bring your own lunch, your own food. In the beginning, I didn't. I used to get lunch there, but now I take my own lunch, and it does make a difference in your paycheck. You wouldn't think that you would spend $100 per paycheck on food, but better to just take your lunch, guys. Um, so, yes. So, my net pay, what I actually got paid on this paycheck was $3,493.30. So. That's with that sign-on bonus, guys, but it got taxed, um, and this was in 2022 as a new grad nurse. Um, I just wanted to be super transparent. I think it's important to know this stuff, and I wish I could have seen a video like this when I was in nursing school. Um, it would have been amazing, and I know it's kind of a thing that we don't talk about, um, but what I don't understand why, you know? Um, but yes, this is only with 73 hours. Um, when you hit, hit the 80 hours, you know, you still get paid your base period flat rate. Um, but you can hit overtime if you go over 80 um, by picking up extra shifts. And usually they have extra incentives that they'll give because we are in the nursing world and we always need nurses and we're always short-staffed, at least where I work at. And so sometimes they will 
you know, do an extra $25 on top or $500 per day, for, you know, for your extra shift. So say you go overtime, you already get time and a half plus that $500. Um, so there's opportunities to get extra money. And I'm not saying this isn't a lot of money because it's, that's pretty good. You know, I was a broke student before this and I, you know, my paychecks were like a hundred bucks just from, I was a CNA and I would just go in a, a day or so and you know that's what I was living off of so this is crazy to see you know like where I've come from from a nursing student CNA broke to now being able to have a wage that can help me in my life in future family and I'm just so grateful for that um, but like I said this was in 2022 so things have changed since then but um, I just wanted to give a breakdown on that first paycheck um, a lot of people are not vulnerable and um, I just want to be that person for you guys hopefully this helps and um, can answer any questions that you guys had but I know there's a lot of websites too that you can look up on how much nurses are getting paid like per department um, like ER medical surgical depending on what unit you are and in what state and what it is that they're paying them at that time per year or whatever it is um so but thank you for watching appreciate it so much i hope to be making more videos if you guys have any questions or any comments anything that you would like to see just let me know in the comments and i would be glad to read those and make new videos for you guys so till next time bye